high-functioning anxiety isn't actually considered a mental health diagnosis. Instead, it's a term many people can relate to when they have anxiety and can still carry out everyday tasks at a functional level. It could be the valedictorian in your class, your coworker who has an exceptionally polished resume, or it might even be you. It's no surprise that this has become widely relevant when roughly 40 million adults struggle with anxiety. When someone tells you you're fine or always has a smile plastered on their face, they might actually need your help. Here are 10 signs of high-functioning anxiety. 1. You're an overachiever. Do you consider yourself a perfectionist, type A, and a planner? People with anxiety always feel like they need control in order to feel at ease. Whether it means making big to-do lists, showing up at a meeting early, or staying up late studying for a test they already memorized by heart, the individual stays busy in order to feel productive. One research study shows that it's only when you feel in control that you can deal with stress. 2. No is rarely used in your vocabulary. Getting things done becomes more important than your health. If you sacrifice eating meals on time or cancel plans with friends to do someone else a favor, you might have high-functioning anxiety. You'd rather suck it up and get the work done instead of saying no, fearing that it might pile up otherwise. You may also be afraid to reject others, afraid that you'll hurt them. So you bite the bullet and you hurt yourself instead. 3. What is sleep? Apparently never enough for people with anxiety. How can it be when you're constantly tossing and turning in bed, consumed by your worries? Anxiety doesn't need a reason to keep you up. You have everything checked off your to-do list and still worry about a million other things. 4. You crack cynical jokes for fun. Are you sarcastic or make jokes about dying? Chances are you aren't as happy as you seem when you tell the punchline. If you're laughing and putting on a show when you're actually suffering, this is anxiety. It forces you to entertain and mask your intensities behind your witty combat. Remember, you don't have to put up a front. Lower your guard and tell people what's going on. 5. Negative self-talk is common. And it's so common that you don't even consider it negative, just your usual way of thinking. People with anxiety are the hardest on themselves. They can stand in front of the mirror and pick out flaws at a snap of a finger, or beat themselves up if they make one minor mistake. They don't give themselves a break, always seeking to be a better worker, student, citizen. The list goes on. 6. Your coworkers consider you a mystery. You might be the helpful, reliable worker everyone loves, so it's no surprise that you'll get asked to go out once it's time to clock out. But you'll usually decline, remaining an enigma. Other people will find it hard to read you, not because you want to seem cold or detached, but letting loose and socializing without preparing ahead of time actually terrifies you. 7. You're easily startled. It's normal to get jumpy during a horror movie, but are you startled even during the slightest disturbance? Afraid that others might find you spineless, therapist Anne Wright says you may resort to unhealthy habits, such as drinking, drugs, or endless social media scrolling as a distraction. 8. Bad days are normal for you. Excessive ruminating, panic attacks, and an inability to relax have all become ingrained in your daily routines, that good days become once in a blue moon. But instead of outwardly complaining or calling up a friend to talk about it, you might just bottle it up. Since it happens every week, you worry that others will find you annoying or a burden. 9. You constantly seek validation. Anxiety makes rationality hard to achieve. That's why the individual often seeks logic from others. They fear their judgment isn't enough, so they rely on the support and guidance of friends, family, and coworkers. They don't mean to lean on people 24-7 but it significantly quiets down their loud thoughts. On the flip side, however, some may worry about being a burden, so they choose to suffer silently instead of reaching out to others. 10. You're afraid of letting people down. You don't know how to break the news to your loved ones if you're not happy with your so-called dream career or don't want the same things as them. You often succumb to other people's expectations, working hard to be a role model. And no matter how tired you are of being you, your anxiety will push you to continue performing as if your whole life counts on it.